Hello, my name is Kelly Epley. This is the second of trainings that we call BGF Worksite Creole. The first one was on expressions used. The second one is basic sentences. Uh, for the next five minutes, I will be using specifically a sheet that we've developed called BGF Worksite Creole. And it's important for me to explain the logic behind this sheet before I begin. Today, uh, for this segment, I will only be using the first column, specifically the pronouns and the common verbs. Pronouns being I, you, he, she, it, we, you, and they. And the common verbs, which are probably 60% uh, of what you say when you're beginning in a language. I want, I need, I can do this, or I do this, and I have. Um, so that's the first column. The second column we'll be spending more time with in the next segment called action verbs. But the logic behind this whole sheet is, and I've seen volunteers do this within an hour, they can actually make a sentence by moving across the sheet. I want to hold the hammer at the house. It works logically across the sheet. So you can use the sheet that way. But for now, for the next three or four minutes, I want to specifically use the pronouns and the common verbs. Moi is the word for I. Moi is also a possessive word. If I say cell phone moi, this is my cell phone. But moi with a nasal sound is the word for I. Ou, ou is the word for you. Um, it often can be shortened to be W sound, like a woo, woo. Like if I say cell phone, woo, cell phone, woo, that's like saying your cell phone. Or woo, allez, that means you go. Woo is the word for you. The word for he, she, and it are all the same words in Creole. And it's a very simple word, you'll hear it all the time. Li, li means it or he or she. Li is the word for um, it. I could say li li, this is a little funny, but li li and say his cell phone. It is its, his cell phone. The possessive and the pronoun are the same there, but li is the third. Uh, the word for we is nu, nu. Um, often in Creole, Nu also means uh, not only we, but it can be a general you statement, as if to say nu la, which is saying you there, including me in that. They don't have a vu as, 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 as is found in normal formal French. They just have the nu. So it's we, nu, and then they is yo, yo. So again, to go through the pronouns, moi, U, li, nu, and yo. Those are very important pronouns to start any sentence. Also, the use of li is very good because it's used for any object. So that's the first piece, pronouns. The next section, which I'll finish, are the common verbs. You'll almost hear this everywhere. The word for want is vle, vle. Um, in Haitian Creole, there is no, there are no conjugations of verbs. So I can say, moi vle, you vle, he, she, or it vle. It all is the same word. So um, if I say moi vle, I want. He wants is li vle. We want is nu vle. That's a very common word, vle. You can say, I want to go, moi vle aller, which is the use of an action verb. Um, the next most common, common verb that's heard is besoin. You'll use this a lot on the site. Moi besoin li, I need it. Um, besoin is the word for need. It's a stronger want than want. It's not, moi vle is one as I want. Moi besoin means I need it personally. Um, the next most common verb is gain, which is to have. Moi gain, moi gain li, I have it, gain. 
And the last verb I want you to practice is kapab, which or it can be shortened to be ka, which means can or to do, can. Um, mwe ka we, I can see. Mwe kapab we, I can see. So those are the beginning of all basic sentences. Your pronoun and the basic common verb. Now, in the next section, we'll be moving on to action verbs specifically. Action verbs almost can serve as a sentence in their own right. In fact, um, as volunteers are leaving to go out the door, I will often give them this sheet and say, make, action, make, make uh, cheat cards out of your action verbs, and you'll be surprised at how well you'll be able to get around a construction site. Haitians can understand you with just using the one word which means hold this, hold, or push, or carry.